Hi guys and welcome to another episode of Encyclopedia. My name is Wes and I'm an instructor here at Eco Training. And here today I have with me a Pragmantis. So today guys, just having a look at this praying mantis, there's a couple of really fascinating things about these guys and they come in all different shapes and sizes and species and subspecies if you like, for lack of better words. Quite interestingly, you'll often see them grooming uh, their, their legs, their wings and more especially those front legs of theirs, those serrated edged front legs and that's for a particular parasite that is quite threatening to the praying mantis as it can create the development of shorter legs, shorter wings and even shorter antennae which can be detrimental to the survival of any species of praying mantis so they really really actively groom themselves. So easily noticed or recognized by those long antennae, that flat forehead, the, the bent forearms and of course the ability to fly. They really are well camouflaged, they have the ability to mimic flowers, dead leaves and even branches. Eggs are often laid in sort of like a, a frothy or clumpy mass um, and then they sort of harden and dry and the egg case is referred to as a uthica. So the name praying mantis actually comes from the fact that it looks like these insects are, pr are praying, physically praying. Speaking of prey, quite interesting, um, praying mantids have a large variety when it comes to what they feed on of different um, aphids, leafhoppers, mosquitoes, caterpillars and other soft-bodied insects when they're young especially but later on in life as they mature they get larger they start feeding on much larger insects such as beetles, grasshoppers, crickets and other pest insects that us as humans might not particularly like. A couple of beliefs there's that the Khoisan worshipped them because of the fact that it gave the, Khoi, the Khoisan the ability to produce words and even fire um, thus allowing them to appreciate the smaller things in life and in nature. So they really do have a pretty special place amongst us as people as well. Thanks for watching another episode of Encyclopedia everybody. If you enjoyed and would like to see more like it, please like and subscribe for more.